another cool feature that uh, we have in the, the dev branch right now is that you can make a request without an ID and that will be treated as a listing or a collection uh, in JSON API lingo. So when you make a request for a collection, what you get is just a list. You can see that data now is an array of all of the articles. Of course, um, this will need some pagination to um, avoid having too much load, but um, which is not built in so far, I think. And uh, yeah, uh, but you can do lists, uh, which you can't with the current REST implementation. Uh, and lists also um, article UID and title. Well, let's put some other changed maybe. Include equals UID and UID and fields on the user is name and fields on the category is na name. So what we will get here is a list of articles and for every article we're gonna include its sorry its author and for every author we're gonna include its preference and since uh, multiple multiple articles can have shared users like uh, article 7 and article 3 may have the same author in the include section we will only have it once so the result payload is smaller so let me do that request and that seems that worked you can see the the sparse field sets taking place for different articles there are two articles and there are two users and just one category yes so you can see how you can start combining the listings with all the features to get the exact data that you need into a single request uh, next on is filters